first and ten. Here's Mahomes. Wide open is Watkins. He's got him. And he's going to get this down to the 35-yard line. That one goes for 24 yards. And on this first drive, looks like they want to get that vertical passing game going early. And they did. And what a warning shot they just fired. If you're not going to back up and play coverage deep, we're going to attack you all game long. And once you adjust to that, you start to back off, then that opens things up underneath. A really nice start for them. Great way to get the game going. We got four. Mahomes now on first down. And his throw is going to be incomplete. Trying to go back to Watkins, and that'll bring up second down. Chances are good. He's going to be a very busy guy. Two catches already in this opening drive, and they were looking his way for hey, a third. Hey, 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 I think hey, they hey. put this defense on notice that that could be a really, really frequent combination. Mahomes will try again on second down. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. Picked off know. by Malcolm Jenkins. He was looking for Watkins that time. Certainly not how they envisioned ending their opening drive here in the first quarter. Too many ones in this play. First quarter, first drive, first interception thrown. And that last one, that hurts. Now it's the Boise State along with Jay Ajayi. Not much there. Maybe a couple up to the 35. Well, we saw him there trying to get it to the outside, run, trying to get to run. the perimeter, but not a whole lot of room there. But there's got to be one positive to that. Hey, four, two, you keep go. moving laterally, creases tend to develop as the game moves on, and they can run it back inside later. That was the ball for this back. This is Darren Sproles. And he has met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. Chris Jones on the stop. And he got off the end there very quickly to make that play. Yeah, it was almost like the bullet train, wasn't it? I mean, just zoom. Quick, quick, quick. And what a terrific play. Holding him to no game. Aguilar has it. And he's going to have a first down as he's brought down at the 44-yard line. So that'll get him the first down as they get nine yards out of that quick slant. Good chip. There we go. Here's a tie. And they went the wrong way there. Losing yardage back at the 43-yard line. It's a loss of a yard there, and now second down. Let's go, let's go. Great, great. And he'll take this one up close to about the 45. It was Reggie Ragland who got him down. Good chip. I know the scouting report on him is that he doesn't possess the eye discipline to be an elite linebacker. And he'll be wrapped up around the waist and pushed down. D Ford coming in to drop him for a loss of eight. And it'll be fourth down. Now on fourth down, it's Cameron Johnston on to punt it away. Tyreek Hill back deep for Kansas City. He'll send this one into the Midwestern air, and it's a good one. So now here are the Chiefs as their offense makes their way back out onto the field. That opening drive ended with the INT. It didn't lead to points, but still not the way they were hoping to begin the game. But how about going and telling your defense, thank you. A huge thank you. You said it didn't lead to points. Stalled off that drive. Now they've got a chance to redeem themselves and maybe reward the defense a little bit. But put some points on the board on this one. And a double coverage, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Malcolm Jenkins. And this one will be returned to right around the 38-yard line. Oh, and I saw the pressure coming at him. That just looked problematic. Hit him as he threw it, and the interception ensued. Let me pay homage to the man who stood in this Four spot before. He always here, talked here. about how much pressure is in the go, face go. of the guy, and can he step into a throw. And when you can't do that, oftentimes interceptions result. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Jay Ajayi, 38 yards. And the Eagles have taken the early lead. 
I know we don't talk about it enough, but the intelligence level of the guys up front blocking, the offensive linemen, maybe the smartest guys in football overall. Add in a little bit of athleticism and a whole lot of toughness, you've got a lot to deal with, don't you? That's why the guys in the backfield get them really nice Christmas gifts, right? If they're smart, they do. Elliott now to kick this one away. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. And out come the Chiefs now. And it's been a miserable start for them offensively. Obviously, two drives, two interceptions. And this is where you have to know your quarterback and know how you actually have to reach him. Do you do it with a little bit of humor? Maybe you break the ice a little bit like, hey, didn't we practice in that color jersey all week? Not the one that you're throwing <laughs> hey, it hey, to? Hey, hey, maybe hey. you have to be stern with him. But whatever it's going to take to get the message, it has to be done. He's putting the game in jeopardy. And here's another interception, the third of this first quarter. Oh, yeah! Picked off by the linebacker, Jordan Hicks. And his guys are going to take over at the 39-yard line. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Here. Go, go. Oh, it to a game. And he'll be brought down, losing yardage back at the 40. That's going to go as a loss of a yard, and it'll be second down. Well, that didn't appear to be a run blitz. He just darted in once he saw the run develop. That appeared to be a case of see ball, get ball. And he'll take this one down to the 36. Give him three yards on the run there. That still leaves him with a difficult third and eight coming up. Typically, we think it's the strong safeties that are better tacklers, especially closer to the line of scrimmage amidst traffic. But in this case, how about the free safety coming up and making the big-time play? Back live with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon. It's the Eagles with the ball here to begin quarter number two. They're facing a tough spot, third and eight here to start things out. deep for his tight ender and this is caught and he'll take it into the end zone for an eagles touchdown zach Ertz, 36 yards and the eagles add on to their lead elliott good on the extra point and it's now 14 to nothing Elliott now to kick this one away. This one taken from the seven. And nice work on the return as they'll start their drive just past the 30-yard line. And now here comes Kansas City. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does. And a lot of the teams script plays. We know that, right? They, they have a script to start the ball game. And typically, those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. <laughs> down two touchdowns early. Probably not very deep into their script. I think they just stay with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some offense on this drive. Anything. At least three points get that zero off the board. Mahomes going to throw. And his throw is going to be incomplete. Ronald Darby that time, the one who got a hand in and knocked it free. It's always a battle. Who's going to win on first down? The offense or the defense? Let's face it. If you've got the ball, four yards and more on first down is what you're aiming for. They tried to throw for it there. Nice effort to knock out, but it will bring up second down. And this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. And here he'll be brought down a little shy of the 35 at the 36. I always laugh when people say, what's the toughest route to defend? I'm like, any of them, especially if it's a good receiver. That makes things very difficult. But when you're running a drag route, something short, hey, hey, shallow, hey, hey, going hey, through hey. defenders, uh, using guys almost as, as screens in order to get over, that makes things tougher for guys trying to get to the football. And he'll go down here at the 35-yard line. Good defense holds hey, hey. him to only a yard, and it'll be fourth down. Uh, here we go with Williams. 
And he works it past the 30, almost to the 25. That's a fourth down pickup of 10 yards and an opportunity certainly missed on the defensive side. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. Throw, throw, throw! Throwing on first down is Mahomes. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Brandon Graham in there to bury him for a loss of 11. Well, someone's been up to the task so far in this game. They are already up a couple of scores, Brandon, and guess what? Been such an impressive first half to get that lead. Looking left side for Watkins, and he's got it. 23 yards on the play. So in the second quarter, he's already up over 100 yards receiving now. And isn't 100 the magic number for a really good game for a receiver? So he got a chance to really shatter that and have a profound effect on this game. That's going to be caught at the 10-yard line. A gain of six there on first. That's a staple of this offense. Drag route to the tight end. Yeah, he's unable to use his size to break off much more ice, yardage ice. after the catch, but still an effective gain nonetheless. On second down, Williams. And he will take it on in for a Chiefs touchdown. Damian Williams taking it in from seven yards away. And the Chiefs are able to get this back within a touchdown. And there you go. That's a really too complex. Block, keep your assignments, let them run it in. They did it. Fundamental football. Good blocking, beats good tackling on that play. End result, touchdown. Butker now to kick this one away. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. And out now come the Eagles. And they had to wait a long time to get the football back. Probably not what you were hoping for when you got an offensive helmet. Agreed. What you were looking for is the defense getting the ball back pretty quickly, right? Hoping hey, for a three and out. Here. So that didn't happen. You can't yell at your D for that. They've got to take care of their own business and reestablish themselves. <laughs> they start out on the ground with the Giants. <laughs> He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. Well, it's time for them to be good teammates right here, and what I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while. Get at least two first downs. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. They'll come up now second and four from the 31. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he'll be brought down right around the 37. A minute 58 to go in this first half of play. We're back to Arrowhead after this. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Great, great. 120. Great, great. Liz, Liz. On the ball. On first down, Wentz. Looking deep for his tight end. And that's caught inside the 35. And he's got this to the 30 before being taken down. A gain of 32 that time. Well, partner, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play. They picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. So the big down play has him all down the way there. down to the 30 now for first and 10. Now a toss play. It's a game. And he'll lose yardage. Brought down at the 32. Now here's a defensive timeout called by the Chiefs. As they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Here we go, here we go. 180. Now they'll run it on the toss. And he will cross the 30 down to the 29-yard line. And the Chiefs are going to signal for and be granted another timeout as they'll talk it over here before what will be an important third down. Three. Hey, Rip 5-7. Go, go. Wait, 20. Lion, lion. 
Here's Wentz to throw. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Carson Wentz with two first-half touchdown passes. And the Eagles had six to their lead. That score was not a game clincher by any stretch of the imagination. The other team now has to be careful to not let this game begin to slip away. Elliott good with a PAT, and it's now 21-7. Elliott now to kick this one away. This will be taken in at the one. And he'll take it past the 25 and up to the 28-yard line. And now here comes Kansas City. I guess they have to feel a little gratified to at least get on the board last time, but still work to do. No doubt about it. I wonder now if they're going to try to increase the urgency a little bit, maybe pump up the pace, maybe go two-minute. Who knows? Let's see what they decide to do. He couldn't quite hold it. Got hit. Ball pops out. Incomplete. Some of the fans here don't seem too happy about what we've seen in this first half. No, not at all. And I understand why they've looked lethargic, out of sync, and it shows on the scoreboard. So now they'll come up on second and ten, once again from the 28. Gotta get the point. Zing, 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 zing. Back to the air on second down. It's Mahomes. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Picked off near the 42. And he'll get this back to the 32-yard line. We haven't even escaped the first half, and he's already thrown four picks. And Brandon, back in the good old days, probably back before you were born, if your starter threw four in the first half, he might throw eight or more for the game because they weren't going to pull him out. But nowadays, the patience level isn't quite there. He's going to have to make some real adjustments or the backup may see some time. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a second and three. Well, no matter how they phrase it, staying on schedule, staying ahead of the schedule, whatever you want to call it, seven yards on first down, that fits the bill. He lost two there, and it's third down. The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts as they stop it here with just under 40 ticks to go in this first half. They haven't made much of this great starting field position they had. Here's third and six. Great, great. Go, go. 180! Shotgun now for Wentz. And finally, down he goes as they work it inside the 10 to the 7. And now we won't see a play on first down. We're going to get a timeout instead. As the clock will stop with 33 seconds to go in the first half. The Eagles into the red zone for the first time. They've got it first and goal at the 7. Now they'll run it on the toss. And he'll take it into the end zone for an Eagles touchdown. Jay and Jay with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Eagles add on to their lead. Elliott good on the extra point. And the decision to just kick the extra point winds up successful. Elliott now to kick this one away. This fielded at the two. Solid return. Pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32-yard line. And now here comes Kansas City. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. And just 25 seconds to go in the half now as they've got tight, it first right. and 10. Tight. Tight is right. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. Caught. Kelsey, left side. And now before this first down play, we're going to get a timeout here. 
As the clock will stop with 20 seconds to go in the first half. Mahomes now 8 of 15 through the air, but it's first and 10 here. To throw, it's Mahomes. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Picked off by Rodney McLeod. And his guys have got it back at the closing stages of the first half. Nice pick, nice pick. Here's Wentz. He's going to let one fly for 10. Oh, this is taken in. It's complete. And this offense going to elect to burn a timeout with five seconds remaining in quarter number two. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield to the 40 now for first and 10. Gold, gold. Here we go. Here we go. 120. Final shot before half for Wentz. He's going to air one out. And incomplete on the deep ball. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. And how about this right out of the locker room? An onside kick attempt. So the Eagles with the lead, and they're going to get this football first as the third quarter gets underway. And that drives coaches insane, doesn't it? When they see that happen, it just, it just doesn't feel right, does it? Plus, you're giving up yardage. So now first and 10 in Chiefs territory at the 47. Now they'll run it. And they go backwards here, losing yardage ball. back at the 48-yard line. It's a loss of a yard there, ram, ram, and now ram. second down. Wow, that play got shut down ram, in a ram. hurry. As soon as the snap came, you could see defensively they were just closing, and that was going nowhere. Yeah, you count on your offensive line to give you a little bit of a game. That's caught inside the 20. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. Give him 30 yards Come on now, here. Come on now, let's go. Now that play will end up on the highlights, and you'll see it all over the place. But yeah, what you won't rap, see, rap. the offensive line that Girl, bought back, the back. extra time that allowed for the big completion downfield, those guys made that play possible. And now we're right through it. And a pretty little juke move there on a nice game. Go, go. It's run, a seven-yard carry to set them up with a second and three. That play wasn't quite as big as the play that preceded it, but still, got to like the way they're moving the football, partner. Absolutely. Pretty good room to run on that last play. Yeah, they didn't get a first down, but still, you'll take runs like that each and every time, won't you? Again with a J. And he's able to work it here to the eight-yard line. It's a three-yard pickup, and that sets up a first and goal. Third quarter, and you've got the lead. You're not ready to go into that four-minute offense to close the game out, but a running game can really benefit your team right now. First and goal. And he'll be stopped just outside the five at the six. It's a gain of a couple, and it'll be second and goal. Defensively, pretty good start there with their backs Come against on now, the wall. Come on now. That's Let's a go. win for the stop troops right there. And if I'm them, I get a little bolder now. They won the first battle. Keep coming after him. Put the pressure on him. He's going to get it really right. And he goes backwards on this one. Losing yardage to the seven. It'll go as a loss of a yard, and it'll hey, set hey, up hey. third down. Partner, I know we're in a goal-to-go go situation, but my goodness. Think about check, running check. the ball here. Not even a thought, yeah, is it? Yeah, defensively, they're in a prime Let's spot. I think the defensive guys are probably expressing themselves to them as well. I wouldn't run it here. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Jay Ajayi run, run, taking it run, in from run, seven run. yards away. And the Eagles That's had it, six baby. to their lead. <laughs> Elliott Good with a PAT. And the decision to just kick the extra point winds up successful. <laughs> Elliott now to kick this one away. This will be taken very short. 
and nowhere to go. He'll make it back only to the five-yard line. In this position, trying to get back into the game, teams are looking for a spark from their special teams. That's not what they got, though. They got a setback, and they have a long right. field to cover if they want to try and put points on the board. Throw, right. throw, throw! Right. Z, 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 Z! Check, four down, four down! They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. And he'll get this up to right around the eight-yard line. The completion good for three, and it's second down. They'd love to just strike back with a touchdown right here, and if it's a long play, so be it. But the main goal, get a couple of first downs. Run some plays, run some clock. Allow their defense to get a chance to catch their breath, settle down, and relax a little bit after they just gave up the score. And he's able to get this one all the way past the 30. That one goes for 24 yards. Mahomes now on first down. And it pops free. The collision there jarred the ball loose and brings up second down. Brandon, at least there's one bright side to that incompletion. What's that? It wasn't an interception. Wow. <laughs> you're, you're a nice guy. That was kind of savage. But correct. No, no pick, just incomplete that time. Here's second and 10 now from about the 32. Two tights, two tights. Four down, four down. Here we go now. Mahomes again here on second and 10, eluding the pressure right. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. And give him 10 that time as he was able to get away from the pressure and get a nice gain. this time down he goes Michael Bannon in there to get him his second sack Michael now of the Brady. afternoon yeah, 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 yeah. And a tough ask here. They're going to go for it on fourth down and nine. Boy, and now they can't even get a playoff. He didn't even try to signal for a timeout, so they must have not been aware of the numbers. I think he lost track of the time left in the play clock and probably was trying to read the defense and trying to figure out which play to run and just lost track, and it cost him. And now a whistle and a timeout called by the kicking team. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. This offense converted once on fourth down earlier. Now they're out there again to try once more. They do go for it. It's Mahomes. And this is Mark. That's Watkins. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. That pickup goes for 25. What a flip of the script from fourth down to first. So from Philadelphia territory now, here's a first and 10 at the 48-yard line. Here's Mahomes to throw. Side and he's got a man. That's Watkins. Three, three and they'll wind up getting this one all three. the way down inside the 20. He got 29 yards that time. <laughs> Operating from the red zone now, Mahomes. This is caught. Watkins. And he takes this into the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown. Sammy Watkins from 19 yards away. And the Chiefs are able to cut into this lead. 
Extra point splits the uprights, and that'll cut the lead back down to 21. After the field goal, here's Butker to kick it away. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. The Eagles coming out as they get ready. That last drive, it was a good mix. Run, pass, run, pass. Defense on their toes. And what really helps out in a big way is when you're doing the run pass mix and everything's working, that means that they're guessing wrong every time on defense. They think you're going to pass the ball. I would continue that. And when they finally draw a bead on you, maybe you mix it up a little bit, a little play action and throw the ball. And will they maintain that balance? Time to find out. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. We're back now in KC. A lot of folks starting to make their way to the parking lot. Their guys trail big here to begin quarter number four. And they had the run for no gain. Now they'll try again from the 25 on second and 10. 53 to Mike. 53. Check. 53. They stay on the ground again. It's a giant. And he'll get this one up to the 26. Just a gain of a yard there, and now it'll be third down. Bottom line, they want to keep this clock rolling, so they'll take that one right there. They just want to keep falling forward, and they want to put the onus on the big fellas up front in order to bring this one home. Tight on the Ringo. Tight on the Ringo. Go, go. 180. Four down, four down, four down. Show an eight. Show an eight. Now with the play clock about to expire, we get a whistle and a timeout. 